Most students just guess this one. Let's try solving it clean. This is math, guys. See, the product of two consecutive integers is 182. What is the larger integer? So let x be the first integer, and then it says consecutive integers. So x plus 1 would be the second integer. Then it says the product of those two, meaning if I multiply x times x plus 1, then it equals 182. Right? Now we're solving this quadratic, so we can distribute the x. We get x squared plus x equals 182. Okay. Subtracting 182, we get x squared plus x minus 182 equals 0. So once we have 0 on one side, we can factor the other side, right? Double bubble. Okay. x and x. Now the numbers that multiply give me negative 182 combined to give me 1. So 13 and 14 work here, right? And so we have positive 1, so we say plus 14 and then minus 13 equals 0. And now we say each factor equal to 0. So x plus 14 equals 0 and x minus 13 equals 0. In other words, x equals negative 14 and x equals 13 would be our possible solution. So since all the answer choices here are positive, then 13 would be the x. And thus, 14 would be the largest of those consecutive ones. Always remember, math is everywhere.